Hey everybody, welcome back to Clutch Situation. I am very excited today to share with you a project whose Kickstarter has just opened as of August 31st, 2023. And what we have here is a new wingback product. Many of you who are fans of the channel know that I very much love my wingback mechanical pencil. Uh, I also have a wingback wallet that I've showcased on the channel for EDC purposes. And this is the newest product from wingback. This is a wingback fountain pen. And one of the things that I love about wingback, in addition to their wonderful attention to detail and quality machining of their parts. I'm also really excited about the fact that Wingback also pushes for sustainability in its products as well, which as a science teacher, someone who has taught climate change for decades now, uh, that is something, that is a mission that is easy for me to get behind in a company. And so, uh, this video is sponsored by Wingback. They sent me this pen for featuring a video on launch day, but I just want to tell everybody in the audience that I plan to uh, back this pen. I've enjoyed it so much. So let's go ahead and open it up and see what we have inside. We have a cardboard case, and then inside that cardboard case, there is uh, what appears to be, I think that this is a canvas, um, could be wrong about that, but this is a canvas case and it says wing back on it. And I really like this because this is a way for you to carry the pen around, uh, quite easily, but also attractively. And I was sent a stainless steel variant of this pen. That's the whole pen right there, because this is designed to be a travel pen. Now, uh, you all know how I feel about knurling on pens. And this wingback fountain pen has diamond knurling on the grip. And that is just something that I love. Um, we're going to take this thing apart and uh, check it out. You can see, uh, hopefully here in the video that it says wingback, you can get these engraved when the Kickstarter, uh, now that the Kickstarter has launched, um, I am planning on getting the, um, Let's see, I, I have my information here. The tungsten carbide coated black steel because I do not have a fountain pen in black metal at all. And so that's what I'm gonna shoot for. Now, if this unscrews at two points, it unscrews here and unscrews here. I'm gonna unscrew it here. One thing that I wanna point out, now many of you know that I'm not a fountain pen expert, but I love, come to love fountain pens. Inside the cap, we do have the typical uh, plastic implement in there that is intended to keep the uh, prevent the ink from drying out. So we'll just set the cap right there. And then the choice of nib on the part of wingback, this is a 076 mono iridium nib that they're using. Um, and uh, this was uh, done by German specialist Peter Bach. Um, this nib is probably the highest quality nib that I've used on a fountain pen that I have purchased. And I've really enjoyed using this pen tremendously and I'm excited to showcase it for all of you. Um, the pen is being kickstarted with four different variants. It's coming in the 303 stainless steel, which is what is depicted here in this video. It also is uh, being manufactured in raw brass, grade five titanium. I would normally uh, side on the side of titanium for my writing instruments, uh, but given that this is also being offered in that tungsten carbide coated black steel, and I've enjoyed the weighting of the stainless steel version of this pen, uh, normally I would not do stainless steel in a mechanical pencil because the size of the writing instrument makes it too heavy for me, but this travel pen modeling has really allowed stainless steel to be a great feel in my hand. And of course, you know how I feel about diamond knurling on a grip. And so this is basically my ultimate combination. Now, if I continue to take the pen apart, one thing that you, many of you may or may not have noticed is that each of the um, sections that unscrews, these are metal machined, also has a rubber O-ring in there. 
and Wingback has mentioned, you notice that I have a cartridge in here. This is a Monte Verde International Standard Short cartridge. It comes with an International Standard Black cartridge. And I haven't really had the chance yet to try out what sort of converters might work in this pen. Um, I'm going to be probably erring on the side of a converter, although I've enjoyed using this uh, Monte Verde emerald ink because I always shoot for uh, green ink in a majority of my fountain pens. Uh, but Wingback also says that because of this O-ring, the chamber is hermetically sealed. And as a result of that, you should be able to just fill this chamber with ink. You'll need to, of course, take pains to keep it clean. But fill this chamber with ink, and given that it is hermetically sealed when uh, with the O-ring, uh, once you screw everything together, you should be able to use the pen just filling the reservoir. Okay, which I know is very exciting for fountain pen enthusiasts. Okay, um, what else do I want to say? I have a I have a press packet here, and so I'm just sort of deciding uh, what I want to talk about. So the tentative plans for this Kickstarter are for it to run from Thursday the 31st of August through Thursday the 5th of October. However, dates are subject subject to change. Uh, I already mentioned that engraving is a possibility here. Uh, many of you, of course, will wonder about cost. These are very high quality writing materials. And uh, so, you know, you pay a premium cost for a writing uh, implement of this type. And uh, I'm more than willing to pay the cost for this. So on Kickstarter, it is going to retail at 95 pounds. That is Great Britain, Great British pounds, um, which I think is roughly somewhere in the $125, $130 US. Um, it's going to depend upon exchange rates, so don't quote me on that. Um, and with an RRP of 150, 15 pounds. Uh, and so you get a little bit of a discount by purchasing through the Kickstarter. Uh, the fountain pen is also going to be available uh, for sale after uh, the Kickstarter ends for the discounted price for a little while. Let me read the exact details. Um, uh, once the Kickstarter closes around the 5th of October, the fountain pen will be available to pre-order at a reduced price via the Wingback website. It will then be available to buy at full price once we've fulfilled all Kickstarter pledges provisionally around January. Therefore, the best price for these items will be in the first few days of the Kickstarter campaign. So you notice that I've posted here, this being a traveler pen, uh, you can write with it as just a short little writing implement. So, you know, if you're riding a train or if you're on a plane and you have, uh, you know, limited uh, arm room, you can write with it in this shortened form. I found in trying this out over the last couple of weeks that I definitely prefer it posted like this. And so let's do a little bit of writing. Uh, so this is the Wingback Fountain Pen. Fine nib. That reminds me, I should tell you what nib sizes will be available for this pen. I uh, have this around here. Looking, looking, looking. It will be available in extra fine, fine, medium, or bold. And the engraved initials, if you choose engraving, can be up to 50 characters. And I'm, of course, I'm not sure of the pricing on that. You can go to the Kickstarter. There will be a link down in the description below that is a unique link that you can take to the Kickstarter from Clutch Situation. Uh, if you are curious, I am using Monte Verde Emerald Green ink with uh, a short international standard cartridge. I just love writing with this thing. Um, I'm not a fountain pen expert, so please don't come at me <laughs> in the comments. Um, you know, I, I have no problem with corrections whatsoever, but please correct kindly. I'd, I'd really appreciate that. And, uh, you know, let, let us know in the comments what you think about this potential offering. 
Um, I am all about on this channel, small manufacturers, regardless of the product. Uh, I feature a lot of small manufacturers on the channel for a very good reason. Um, I support small businesses wholeheartedly. I spend extra uh, to purchase writing implements from small businesses. Um, you know, check out one of my top 15 videos if, if you'd like to know the, the sorts of uh, um, uh, the sorts of manufacturers that I support. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm super exciting for this and I'm going to be a day one backer in the uh, tungsten carbide coated black steel and I'm going to get engraving as well. Uh, and so I'm super excited to share all of this with you in my audience. I know that many of you are mechanical pencils, but if you're into fountain pens, check this out. And uh, yeah, this is, this is just an, another awesome opportunity to get a very fine writing instrument. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed watching the video and go check out that Kickstarter right now. Thanks everybody for watching. Have a great day.